Good morning, good evening, and good afternoon, ladies and gents, and welcome back to Ostriv. And I cannot believe we are already in year six. Literally, cannot believe we're already in year six. Like this, this settlement seems to have expanded so much since we started. And you know what we're gonna do today? We're gonna, well, this year actually, we're gonna expand it even more. <laughs> so my idea is to kind of try and make this whole settlement pretty much self-sufficient i want to rely on the uh, outside world as little as possible so we have our fishing docks being created we have our boats being created uh, i'm going to pro i think we have mm, yeah we have a lot of people looking for jobs okay i'm gonna leave four people doing logs or doing forestry permanently i think five is a little bit too much because it gets things get filled up quite quickly <laughs> and even though we're using them and we have storage for like what 20,000 wood things get filled up pretty quickly so we have our two fishing ports being built down here we go ahead we're gonna go ahead and make another farm over here and I think I'm gonna do it really quite central so that instead of because we could always just add this farm and then add fields over here problem with that is to sow the fields they would have to be going backwards and forwards and backwards and forwards and backwards and forwards and that is way too far um but in doing that in theory i can wipe out these two fields even transfer those fields to this farm as i said right from the start the layout of this town, the layout of our assessment is absolutely atrocious and I have every intention of changing it. So to actually, because the, <laughs> the way I work, is unless I start something, I just, I, I have the my, I have the idea in my head and then it will never actually get done unless I start something. So I think the first thing to do will be to remove these two fields. So once this year's harvest is over, I'm going to remove these two fields and then these fields will be set up along with this farm and i can possibly move these three fields over to there it's the idea and then we'll put some other stuff down here what i do want to also make is i was having a, a looky thing at some stuff and we're gonna make a weaver shop again i'm gonna have to put it somewhere really really awful and awkward um can we tuck it in here somewhere i think we probably can yeah, because we've got loads of people on the trees anyway. So we will tuck it in here. Make sure we can actually put other things around it as well. So we're going to have a weaver shop to use our hemp. So I've done a little bit of work. Obviously, we've got our two fishing docks up and running or being built, I should say. Uh, we have our farm being built. I've added a weaver's workshop and a second charcoal pile because I'm concerned that the, with the size of our settlement one is not going to be enough to supply it we also have construction of three orchards getting set up here as well as a salt works because salt is going to be needed for quite a lot of stuff that we're going to be wanting to do in the upcoming years however the biggest project that we have going at the moment which is going to take a lot of resources we are building a bridge Oh yes, we are building a bridge to try and unlock this central area. Now, the most important part about this central area is just over here. Because limestone <laughs> is quite important. <laughs> and it is very, very necessary. We have, uh, I think it's... I don't actually know where the stone deposits are. Are they here? Yes, they're here. Oh, two reasons to go over there then. <laughs> I thought the stone deposits were over there. Two reasons we need to build a bridge. Because <laughs> we need stone as well for future projects. So, the one thing I am a little bit concerned about is the fact that we don't have a lot of wheat. And we are burning through our wheat like crazy, making flour. However, what we do have a metric arse ton of is buckwheat and potatoes. So, I am going to go ahead and... I'm I don't oh no you can't do it for these guys you can only do it for the pigs and the maybe the chickens yeah so I'm gonna go ahead and add 
400 to each one of these just so in case that we run out of wheat they can use something else we also have a massive amount of um <laughs> we have a we have a lot of sunflower oil holy crap okay uh are we storing sunflower oil we are not storing sunflower oil can we store sunflower oil in here we can store sunflower oil in here wonderful Let's just make it 5,000 because we have a lot of sunflower. We have a lot of sunflower seeds. Now, I don't know. I think you can sell sunflower oil, right? You can sell sunflower oil. Wonderful. But my main objective at the moment, which I don't think I'm going to achieve this year. I think I'm going to achieve it maybe by... I, I'd like to think I can achieve this by year 10. But is the manufacture of clothes. As I said, I want to make, I want to make our settlement self-sufficient. So... Let's get going because it's already like 10 minutes into this bloody recording <laughs> and we haven't even finished through January. We've got all of the... How are we doing on water? Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Oh dear. Are they all that bad? No, you just have to go a long way for water. Okay. No, that's full up. Okay. No, it's fine. It's fine for the moment. Okay. Uh, oh, one thing I do want to do though is I want to put... Yeah, I want to put a warehouse. I want to put a warehouse here. I also want to fit a granary in, but I don't know where I can fit. Can I tuck it in just there? Hmm, no. I definitely want to have a warehouse in there, just because it's a long way to go for the resources for these stools. So even having two of them doesn't... Oh, actually, can I fit it, can I fit it in there? It's not hugely closer, but it's definitely closer, closer. <laughs> yeah, let's do that. Let's do that. It's not, it's not too much of a diversion. That's, that's bearable. We still only had one death, haven't we? Yes, good. Right, so, charcoal pile is complete? What? Why did that complete? They haven't, they haven't finished doing the fishing dock yet. How does that work? <laughs> well, okay then. <laughs> Preempt away. Uh, I am slightly concerned about how long these orchards are going to take because they have to cut down a metric ass ton of trees to uh to get them to a point where we can actually use them okay so we are we're we are going through resources pretty damn fast geez the firewood isn't even and i'm only having one on there aren't i the firewood isn't even making it to the storage it's being sold <laughs> it's being sold so fast yeah see now we don't have any charcoal Ch charcoal what the hell is charcoal we don't have any charcoal. <laughs> uh, oh, we got more than enough in the smithy, so that's no problem. Actually, I'm going to put a lot more of you on because we have tons of iron. Where's our... Yeah, we got absolutely tons of iron and we are going to really, really be needing nails. Speak of the devil. They run out of nails. <laughs> We're going to really, really be needing nails, so... That's not an issue. I'm going to put one person on there purely because I think we're going to be needing him. <laughs> Hope I'm hoping that he will do preventative repairs on these chaps. Do you know what? I might actually make a second cart shed. That's a very, very tempting proposition. How big is it? Or actually, should I just... Because you have to hire people to have cart to do the cart shed. Should I just have a cart stool? Would that be better? I feel like that would be better. It's a lot less resource. Oh, it's only it's only. Oh no, it's a lot less resources. It's a lot less resources. <laughs> Holy crap! Okay. Sorry guys, you're gonna have a cart shed right in front of you. I'm really sorry. Right in that case, I'm actually gonna demolish that. Oh, okay. Oh, awesome. So we don't even need to build that many cards. Okay, nice. So once those are built, uh, I'm actually going to push them ahead because they will be very, very useful. And then once those are built, I can order more and then more can be being built while everything else is being built. So efficiency, that's a good choice. So that's all going well. Construction is going well. Farms growing just fine. Um, so we don't need people on that. I'll leave one there. Bulls are being created. 
so I will. What I'll do is once we have another ball, I will turn that ball and that ball into oxes, and then I'll probably slaughter the older cows. The only issue we do have here is thinking about it. That's gonna. I want to come back to that icon in just a moment. This. <laughs> Uh, yeah, that's going to be a massive thing. Holy crap. There's going to be a lot of animal inbreeding. Well, it's a good thing diseases don't exist in this game. <laughs> Holy moly. That's going to be a hell of a lot of animal inbreeding. Holy crap. That's also something we can do with this with these fields. Is I can fit in slaughterhouses here. I don't know how big are the slaughterhouses. I want to come back to the clothes. Yeah, family is lacking clothes, which means they're probably going to end up moving out. Because they they have tons of money. What are you complaining about? Go and... I was about to say go and buy some clothes, but you can't buy some clothes because we don't make clothes, do you? Uh, smart guy. Okay, so. Farm is complete. We're right at the end. Now, this is a, this, this is a decision I have to make. We don't have many people looking for jobs. But I'm sure the labourers would sweep in there and fill up the positions easily. We're at the end of March. So if I go and build a bunch of farms over there, they will sow the crop. But do I actually need it? I suppose we could go for a massive haul of wheat. Like a seriously huge haul of wheat. And then we wouldn't have to worry about flour for a while. Yeah, let's do that. Let's do that, actually. Right, in that case, we're going to have a manager. Um, we don't want to prioritise gathering. I just realised that. Um, let's make sure these docks have ordered boats. Yep, so they are building away. Wonderful. Right. Question is, how many fields are we actually going to make? I think I'm, I'm thinking at least four. I kind of want to surround the farm itself. Actually, if I put... If I put one in front, then I will know the width that I have to go. No, nope, come on. 50. Give me 50. There we go. <laughs> 2,410 units. What? That's such a weird number. Okay. Right. So, if I do that, that way I will know the width that I need to go for the next fields. <laughs> this is going to look really, really weird. Actually, if I go like that, then in theory, I can fit services inside of this thing that I'm going to need. See, that's 2,500. Why, is the, why was the other one 2,410? That makes absolutely zero sense. I'm sure there's no reason for it, but whatever. Okay, now I've got to be careful here, because I... Are those... <laughs> it's not even straight. <laughs> I don't think it's even... <laughs> I'm going to ignore that. It's such a good thing I don't have OCD. Right. Uh, that will do about there. Okay, to be fair, that's actually come out at quite... That front edge has actually come out at quite a nice, dis nice distance to that. I'm actually quite proud of that. There's no, like, angles you can work out. Just slightly annoying. This is where you need, like, the... Yeah, see, why is that? It's 2490. How does that work? Okay, so it's a little bit further away than... Ah, uh, okay. Uh, genuinely, I thought that one was... F I thought I put that one further away than that one. Oh, well. We can't all be perfect. <laughs> right, in that case, this, in theory, should line up quite... Well, does it not? Oh, no, because that one's further away, isn't it? Uh, smart guy. Oh, actually, in theory, that means we could actually tuck this guy inside. Okay, it needs to be a little bit further over. Look at that! 
that's kind of in my mind what I wanted to do, but I wasn't sure whether I could actually pull it off with the measurements. So, 50... This is going to be a low yield. Oh, no, it isn't. It's fine. I just... <laughs> my brain wasn't working properly. Ah! Okay, so it's quite askew, but... <laughs> I don't have any measuring tools, so like, I don't know how I can... I don't know how I can solve that. <laughs> Right, so active, 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 active. Okay, so we want to do... Where's our grainy? We're doing a massive haul of wheat. Everything's... Okay, everything's going to be wheat. Everything already is wheat. Wonderful. Right. Labourers, come and sow seeds. Do that. <laughs> That's gonna get sown pretty damn fast. Holy moly. Now, if you've watched my uh, Alpha 7 patch 4 update video. No, that's not what it is. My Alpha 4 patch 7 update video. <laughs> get it the right, I'll get it the right way around in a minute. Um, you will know that there is a bunch of stuff that I actually discovered in making <laughs> that update video that I didn't know about this game, which are going to be really, really helpful. And I am actually really looking forward to uh, to messing about with in the future. Um, one pertaining to these houses, particularly when I build more houses, I am certainly going to use that. Question is, do I do I relocate? And then we only have to build four. No, we only have to build three. Nice. Right, so Carpenter is building the carts. Dockyard is still building boats. Wonderful. The what did it say was what did it say was finished? It said something was finished, and I've something. Oh, is it this? Ah, it's the weavers. The weaver finished. I mean, no hemp. There is tons of hemp. <laughs> there is absolutely metric ass tons of hemp. Right. Go and deconstruct that, because that will give you a ton of wood. Actually, we don't really need wood, do we? Do we even need nails? Oh, we need nails. Holy crap, we need nails. Okay, I'm going to put that till the back. I'm actually going to put all of these to the back, because... It's going to be a while until we've cut down all those trees. And that can go and help make the salt box, which we definitely need. Um, everything else is not hugely problematic. Yeah, that was the clothes issue, but we can't... Oh, was it the clothes issue? Yeah, it was the clothes issue. But we can't really solve that. I wish there was... I really would like an overlay to be able to see... Yeah, see, this is the issue we're having. The travel time is huge. That's why... Do you know what? I'm going to go ahead and push that warehouse through because we need that warehouse there badly. That travel time is really, really hurting us now. Ah, God, where everything's going downhill. Everything is majorly going downhill because we don't have any firewood. Okay, um... Temporarily pause construction. We don't have any firewood. We don't have any nails. We don't have any wood in general Things are going really really badly Actually, can I just Let's instead let's because we want to pause construction But go away Oh damn it. How can I Okay, we can't pause construction with Okay, we really <laughs> We really need that warehouse built. That's really bad. Yep, everyone's running out of money. We're running out of fire. Oh, God. Oh, no. <laughs> We're literally selling firewood faster than we can make it. Oh, this is not good. Right. So, we need to store... <laughs> I was about to say, we need to be able to store a lot more than that in there, buddy. I don't care that it's not available. We need to be able to store it. 
yes take from other warehouses um that i mean i can hire laborers but it's not going to do anything because there's no <laughs> there's no firewood we might actually need to make a second forestry i'm gonna make a second forestry we really really badly need it pause every other bit of the construction and concentrate on building the forestry because we need that really badly not that we can really do it because we don't have any nails because we don't have any charcoal <laughs> oh balls this is not good this is really really not good i could really do with a messenger showing up right now um actually no you're fine you're fine keep keep making boats boats don't matter boats are fine because we're making wood that's not the issue we need firewood <laughs> firewood is literally being sold faster than we can make it <laughs> that will disappear yeah jeez did you see that right yeah make don't worry about bark just make goddamn firewood <laughs> we need to we need to stock up okay finally we're baking charcoal and now we can create firewood Whew. okay panic just about over <laughs> Wowza, that was, jeez, that was genuinely scary for a moment there, that was really, really scary for a moment there, so we only lost about 10 people, so it's not the end of the world, but that was a very scary moment there, things could have gone sideways very, very fast on that. Right, what are you doing in terms of boats? Have you finished? Yep, okay. Three boats there, please. Three boats there, please. Thank you. And now you can... Yeah, you can go and just chill for a while and find other jobs. <laughs> uh, let's... Do we have a huge amount of thatch? No, we do not. Okay. Let's get some thatch going, please. Charcoal is a-okay, so let's deactivate those for a while because we need to concentrate on building up a stock of firewood. To be honest with you, by the time that's going to be used up, we're going to be fine on firewood. Then it was just we were expanding so quickly. It really, really hurt us. <laughs> okay, so that's full. That's full. That's empty. Actually, is there a... Oh... Okay, can you stop making bark? Because we're going to need it. But not right now. <laughs> oh, we're harvesting, gents. Okay, you are required elsewhere, please. Everyone is required elsewhere. I'm not building anything at the moment, even though I probably should be. But farming is more important. Right, so as soon as that field's empty... We can delete it along with that one. Uh, we actually ended up putting the slaughterhouse somewhere else, didn't we? Yeah, let's cancel that. Keep the sort of works going. And then we're building up a nice stockpile of nails now, which will be good for the bridge. Don't know that we'll get I don't know that we'll get the bridge built this year. Okay, you can work in the we need flour again because we've run out <laughs> it's kind of that it, it just it's that balance it's hard to get and I know there's I know there's stuff set up that like yearly amount but I I need to get back into the flow of understanding oh yeah we have no workers <laughs> we have no builders because they're all on the farms <laughs> Wow, I stabbed myself in the foot with that one a bit, didn't I? Jeez. Okay, so. Slaughterhouse is going to... Do you know what? Actually, let's prioritise gathering on this one because... 
that field's nearly finished anyway. And as soon as this field is empty, then we can pop the slaughterhouse in there. Actually, I kind of want to put it here just because it would be slightly closer to these guys. Uh, we really need another bull to be born so that we can... <laughs> I just realised how aggressive that sounds. We really need another bull to be born so that we can kill the other ones. Good job. Uh, Money-wise, yeah, we're doing all right. Uh, we we have more than we started with, <laughs> so <laughs> that's a good start. Where was the ones that were like super super rich? Oh, oh, they were the ones that moved out because of the clothes issue. Yeah, I think they must have worn through their clothes. Okay, so in that case, we are. Oh no, oh, we've made all the. Oh. Okay, so let's start selling sunflower oil. How much milk do we have? Not a huge amount. We're not really producing a huge amount of milk. Uh, I can't store that in there, but what I can do is sell sunflower oil. No, that's why we need the granary, because we need to be able to store buckwheat closer to the stalls. Okay, so everything is working. Things are working. Um, we need stone for the salt works, which I don't have. So we do actually need the bridge to be built. Yep, we need it built. Damn. Okay then, that's a thing. <laughs> right, so that's getting sold. That's getting shifted. We don't need you anymore because we don't have any more sunflowers to turn in stuff. Um, I suppose we could just do a whole year of hemp production, to be honest. Uh, where am I supposed to be looking for this? <laughs> I can't remember where I put my hemp storage. Did we even do hemp storage? Or was it just sitting in the farm? I think it might have just been sitting in the farm. I don't think we did hemp storage. We've run out of it anyway. So, right, what can we turn? I saw we could turn hemp into something. Make textile from it. So, what could, I can't remember what we can even use textile for. Uh, okay, so we need wool and sheepskin. <laughs> okay, so we need sheep. <laughs> right, yo, we need sheep. Can I tuck it in there? No, not quite. Oh, I can tuck it in there, though. That's a bit tight. But I can tuck it in there. Yep, let's do that. Right. Ladies and gents, we are having sheep. <laughs> right. Um, that's literally pointless. That is quite literally pointless. I didn't realise quite how pointless that structure is. Oh, bugger. Oh, well, that went to crap fast. Ha <laughs> ha That really went to crap fast. We have no potatoes. No buckwheat. No flour. Oh my god. Um okay. Right, let's put those back to zero. <laughs> That's bad. That's really bad. Okay, so we have Oh, bugger. <laughs> okay, we're going to have to have a serious, serious thought about what we do. Um, okay, so... Farm. How do I move this farm to a... Yeah, I need to link it to another farm. There we go, that's what I wanted to do. That's what I wanted to do. Now, the issues I'm... Oh, no, I can't do that. I can't... Now, see, this is a classic example of I've expanded too fast and I don't have the systems in place to support myself. I'm actually going to leave... I'm going to leave these fields on that farm and I'm going to set them to that for next year. <laughs> 
<laughs> oh, this is really bad. This is really, really bad. <laughs> Okay, so we have, we have fish, we have flour, we have firewood, we just don't have potatoes or buckwheat, and we're not going to have that until, like, August, September time of next year. Let's get the sheep farm built. And did we get the slaughterhouse done? It's, that's what we're getting, but okay, so... We need to get the slaughterhouse built so that we can have meat. Because... <sighs> oh no. We need to... Have a way of getting ourselves through this winter. <laughs> uh, let's remove salt. Because we're not producing it yet. So there's no point in having it there. And we just... <laughs> Put those back in construction because we need to get rid of the trees on them anyway. Oh, God. Well, at least, I mean, we're making nails which have been used up so fast. Holy crap. Are people looking for jobs? They are. Guess we can build stuff faster? Yeah, let's just build stuff faster. <laughs> Because we're now, we're now having issues. <laughs> we are now seriously having issues. Right, so they've made tons of thatch. Okay, we don't need you anymore. So let's get people in to thresh the harvest. Whoa, what happened there? Why did we jump? I have no idea. Anyway, uh, let's get more people in to thresh the harvest and get that done. People are running out of water again. Oh, crud. Oh, wow, they're really running out of water. <sighs> okay, and winter's on its way. <laughs> Things are falling apart pretty damn quickly here. Um, build a platform, please. <laughs> we need the water. <laughs> <laughs> I want to get that bridge done, but like so many things are so much more important than the bridge. Wonderful. That is done. Yeah, 100% use fallow fields if available. Right. That is being constructed. So we will then be able to have sheep. <laughs> um, where's my... Did oh no. That was a sheep farmer, not a slaughterhouse. Oh crap, build the bloody slaughterhouse. Where's the slaughterhouse? <gasps> Can I build the slaughterhouse? Which way is it facing? There we go. We'll have it next to the water. Oh dear. Slaughterhouse is a more priority. Sorry guys. Can you go and build this bloody slaughterhouse? Please, for the love of God. <laughs> How are we going to get through this winter? I don't know. It's just going to be purely on the sale of... Well, at least we have tons of eggs, and we're not even selling eggs, are we? <sighs> okay, let's sell eggs. <laughs> sell eggs instead of flour, because we have more than enough flour to go around. <laughs> there we go. Um, we can... Actually, the chickens create chickens. We yeah, obviously chickens create chickens, but... The chickens create edible chicken when they die, I think. I don't think you can actually manually slaughter them. They reproduce that mental <laughs> holy crap. And it's already January. Bucker. Okay. So let's slaughter a cow. Let's we have a bunch of boars, so anything over I'm gonna do like from there up. We're gonna slaughter. We actually need more carts, holy crap. <laughs> Oh, we can build. Let's build back to back. No, we can't because there's not enough space. Um, that'll be enough for the moment. Uh, I want to prioritize carts over the orchards 110%. 
I kind of just want to build. I want to build the end of the bridge before, but I need to stop because it's January. Actually, that would work out as quite a good thumbnail. <laughs> right, so everything's kind of gone to crap temporarily. Um, we're going to have to do <laughs> a year of getting in a lot more crop. Um, so, the two buckwheat and a potato. So, if we do. I oh know because we said we were making more hemp, didn't we, as well? So, we've had. It was two buckwheat and a potato, wasn't it? Yeah. So, if we do two buckwheat and potato there, we'll do two uh, potato and one buckwheat. And then the other one can be hemp. Yeah, that works. Awesome. Right. In that case, that is it for year six. In year seven, get the bridge done. Set up the stonework. Set up the lime works as well. Get the salt works finished. Um, probably slaughter a few more animals. Hopefully, we have another bull born. Because then we can make ox. And we can get rid of that cow as well. And hopefully, we we haven't had a single messenger this year. That was crazy. Not a single one. So hopefully next year we'll get a messenger or we'll send a messenger out. We'll get some sheep. And then we can probably put the clothes production in here. Maybe somewhere like that. Kind of the general idea. Kind of the general plan. Anyway, ladies and gents, as always, thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for the support. If you have an idea for a name for this community, please let me know down in the comments because we have yet to name it. And I will see you in year number seven.